Hey, how's it going everybody? Burr Brian here. And you know, root beer ales have become quite popular and they're popping up all over the place. And today, I've got a new one to share with all of you. So, come along and catch a buzz with me. So a couple weeks back, I put up a video for a root beer called Not Your Father's Root Beer, and it was a really tasty beer. It's the one that could really kind of get you in trouble, though, because you, you just really do not taste the alcohol that's in it at all. It's just like drinking a root beer soda. And I've heard from some of my friends say that this one is better than that one, so we're going to give it a shot and see what we think. This one is from Coney Island Brewing, and this is their hard root beer. Uh, this one... It's, I love the label on it. It's pretty cool. It's a giant mug, a frosty mug with the roller coaster rides going around. It says, are you tall enough to ride? Thrill your taste buds. And this one comes in at 5.8% per volume, so it definitely has a nice alcohol content to it. On the back it says, the gypsy should have predicted this. The most dignified beverage of days past, reimagined for your future self. The wooden planks under your feet and a hot dog in your hand. The only difference is that now you're tall enough to ride this ride. Very, very cool. I really like the way that says there. Coney Island, where anything is as possible if you're ready to hashtag take the ride. Very, very cool. I'm, I'm uh, definitely digging this. It says, Coney Island Hard Root Beer is a new twist of an, on an old favorite with hints of vanilla, licorice, and birch. This root beer will bring you back to the boardwalk. Very cool. Let's go ahead and uh, get right into it. Great carbonation on that one. You know, popped right open. Let's see what we've got on the pour here. Yep, just what I was expecting. Obviously a very dark beer. And, oh, nice little bit of uh, carbonation there, but I'm imagining the carbonation might die down quickly. The head might disappear soon, but I'm not too sure. Definitely smells like root beer. I want to say like an A&W smell. Ooh. All right, let's give this one a shot. Wow. All right, so... This one compared to Not Your Father's. Not Your Father's was more, I don't know, it was like a more watery version than this. This has really got got the strong birch flavors again in there. You've got that the, the good, strong, like almost a syrupy, thick root beer taste. Wow. Yeah, really, really tasty beer. I'm loving this one so far. But, again, my opinions can always change from first sip to last, so I'm going to sit back, relax, sip on this one for a few minutes, and I'll be back with my final verdict at the last drop. And here we are with a good gulp left. Like always, this one's for all of you. Salud. Alright, so my original assessment stands that this one is more of a thicker, more more of a stronger root beer like flavor uh, than than say your not your father's root beer. But I honestly like the other one better. This one to me, it just it's, I I don't know maybe it's the thickness in it. It's just something about it really kind of puts me back a little bit. I mean, definitely still easy to drink a really good root beer uh, ale, but. Again, I just felt like uh, Not Your Father's was so much smoother, easier to drink, uh, you know, uh, easier to pound several of them in a row. This one's more filling, uh, so again, it, it all depends on, uh, you know, what your preferences are. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, it's, I don't know if I would uh, go out and pick this one up again if I'm given the option of the other beers, um, but, uh, you know, I, I definitely wouldn't turn it down if it came around uh, again. But uh, anyway, don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe to me if you haven't already so you don't miss out on any future content. Um, you can join me on all the various social networking sites like Instagram, Google+, Twitter. I'm on uh, Facebook. You can join me on the Steam Network if you play video games. And if you're a connoisseur of fine craft beers, you can follow me on Untapped and we can talk about new and exciting beers. But uh, anyway, I hope you guys enjoy. And as always, stay toasty, my friends. <laughs>